Good morning, siblings. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, make sure to subscribe and turn on the post notifications. Okay, now that that's done, my hair is wet and I'm freezing, so we are going to dry myself. Can't ever get this to go in the plug. Just go, okay? Got it, okay. Look at my goosebumps. Well, that's one way to get warm. Except now, I'm just cold again. I need a jacket. Oh my gosh, so much better. And guess what? You can get the best sweatshirt ever also at sydneyforsyth.com. I'm so cold. I thought it was supposed to be summer by now. I'll show you why I'm so angry and cold. Ready? It's raining and it's cold and I'm not enjoying it. Going back inside, I'm still cold. 45 degrees outside in May. I thought it was supposed to be like 60s. What are you doing? Come cuddle me, I'm cold. How are you not wearing a sweatshirt? I'm freezing. What's the so temperature cute. in the house? 70. Can we make it like 80? No, <laughs> Sydney, it's not that cold. I'm freezing. Hey. <laughs> Sydney, what do you want to do today? Nothing. I'm tired. I don't want to do anything. We woke up earlier than two for the first time in t two weeks. Come on. It's cold. Yeah. That's why you have a jacket on. I'm not motivated. It doesn't matter if you're motivated or not. We got to do stuff. I don't want to. Well, you're being ridiculous. I know. <laughs> you need to put you in the car. Show them the piggyback thing that you do when I don't want to get up. Come on, Sydney, let's go. I don't want to go! <laughs> Sydney's acting like a little kid doesn't want to go to school. <laughs> I'm just going to leave that on in case you... I'm getting up, maybe. I don't know. I'm going to Hate this in-between stage of kind of wet, kind of dry. Anyway, as you can tell, I'm having a little bit of a rough morning. But I'm still here. Shout out to my husband for making me do stuff when I don't want to get up. Otherwise, I'd just lay in bed all day. We have to go return a bunch of stuff for Amazon. And, um, yeah. So, let's just go. Temperature all the way up. Thank you. Heated seat on. Blanket. And a hoodie. This is what happened. It's literally 53. It's not even that cold. I'm just, it's been warm. And so, this, like, random coldness is, like, really not vibing. Especially because it's rainy. Later this week, it's supposed to be warm and rainy. I like that cold and rainy. I don't like that. We're gonna go to Dallin's parents' house because I have to print something out to return some stuff. So I had to say thank you. It's too cold. I want to get out of the car. No! Stop playing! It's raining. It's raining. <laughs> How are we gonna get inside? The garage. But then I have to stand in the rain. I don't want to get wet. Here, you you can wait in the car. I'll go up in the garage and then you can just dead sprint. Okay, I'm ready. All right. You go do that. I'll be here. Do you want the camera? No. Why is that extra rain right there? Because the gutters aren't clean. <laughs> oh, hello, Axel. Today. Oh. <laughs> I did it. We're gonna return it. American Eagle is gonna be like, wow, whoever sent this is so cute. Open it, open it. No, I've got to send it to someone. Did we do it? We did it. Oh. oh. Getting more better. That doesn't make sense. I'm getting better. I'm personality Get working out. I'm waking up. I don't know. Anyway, I'm feeling better. So, I don't know if you guys knew this about me, but I actually can't see. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I just have like not the greatest vision. I can see like good enough, but when it's night, I can't see anything. But the problem is these are the only glasses I can find. And I look so dumb in them. Like I never wear them, but I'm gonna put them on. <laughs> like everything's so clear. I really need to get new ones. Like so bad. So Cindy, how are you feeling about um, returning these things? I'm, okay, I don't know if you guys knew this, but I've never returned anything in my whole life because I like, I'm too scared to go in. <laughs> 
See, this is why I never do anything. I went in and I said all the wrong things and it got complicated <laughs> and I felt awkward. I'm mortified I'm never going back. We're back home, as you can tell. I don't really have much to do for the rest of the day. We're just kind of hanging. So, uh, a while ago, I asked you guys on Instagram some questions. And I did like a survey and I was really Ooh. excited to see the results. So me and Dallin are gonna read them and react to them and all that good stuff. This is what you came here for. And Ace is being featured. I look like a, this a is mom. like a 40 year old mom trying to Okay, here we go. Here are all the results. I think I, I asked like 10 things. Okay, okay. Okay, ready? I'm so ready. Okay, I'm gonna put Ace away. Okay. Gonna get serious. Gotta put him away. Gotta go put him in the drawer. Uh oh, uh -oh. he's playing <laughs> with the camera. Oh, he's totally gonna ruin it. He's gonna jump. Oh. Uh Oh my, oh. <laughs> oh. I wish we had a cam right here. Oh, there he is. So, which one is better, Spotify or Apple Music? Oh my goodness. You guys said 67% Spotify, 33% Apple Music. I'm not surprised by this. I, I think yeah. most people use Spotify, and especially considering like Androids could also use Spotify, that could up oh. the percentages more. Let's be honest here, Spotify is just so much better. Way better. So much like, easier to use. Yeah. It's share music. So just just amazing. use Spotify. Yeah. Just, yeah. If you use Apple Music, let us know down below why you use it, because I'm yeah. actually kind of curious. Also, like our Google Homes, they connect to our Spotify. You can like turn Spotify on your laptop or whatever, all from your phone. So like while we're playing games, I'll listen to Spotify and I can change it on my phone so I don't have to interrupt Ooh, my game. That and, is like, true. If you have Spotify, you can use it on your Xbox, but with Apple Music, you can you only can't. use it on Apple. Yes. Yeah. Okay, and then I wanted to see how this correlated, but which do you use, iPhone or Android? I don't think I'm surprised by this at all. 89% iPhone, like, come on. I, it, Everyone uses ever, yeah, Honestly, it. if you use an Android, like, I'm sorry that you like bad quality. Like, we always make fun of his brother, and it used to be my brother, but he just got an iPhone because he has an Android, and it turns our group chats green. Ugh. No one likes a green group chat. Android emojis just ain't it. All right, next up. Here's the ultimate question. And I'm actually a little bit surprised here. I said, do you use Xbox or PS4? And 58% said Ooh, Xbox. It was close. I honestly thought it'd be more. Cause I mean, back in the day I used to use, I had a PS3 and so I just kind of figured, cause you switched to Xbox, I use Xbox and everyone I know uses Xbox. So it kind of in my head was like, oh, everyone just like has an Xbox. But it's funny because he will, he will always be like, oh, just press circle. And I'm like, what? Circle, square, triangle. Cause it's like B-A-Y-X on mine. Yeah. So honestly, I, I'm pretty happy with this. It's glad to see it's like almost 50 50 yeah it's funny though because it from my perspective yeah. all of my friends have ps4s that are like really? high school vibe but the only people i know with xboxes is the people around us like yeah. you all and your the people yeah. i play with have so Xbox. it's just it's pretty even yeah, it's split pretty even. are you an introvert or an extrovert I was actually surprised, but now that I think of it, it makes more sense because 61% are introverted. Oh yeah. I feel like that makes sense because when you think about like the world, everyone can't be an extrovert. Like it just <laughs> wouldn't work out. Extroverts are annoying and crazy and I can say that because I am one. I feel, I don't know, I just feel like it makes more sense. I am a little bit surprised though. Like I thought it'd be even, but now that I think about it, it just kind of makes sense that there's less extroverts. Okay, do you prefer the indoors or the outdoors? And I wanted to see how this related to introvert versus extrovert, but it doesn't relate at all because 72% <laughs> said outdoors. And I thought maybe outdoors was more of an extroverted thing, but honestly, introverts could love it too because you just kind of hang out outside. So, oh yeah, nature, you know. And yeah, I'm actually a little bit surprised by this. I thought it'd be pretty evenly split, but we've got 72% of people are loving the outdoor. All right, do you wear more Neutral colors or bright colors? <laughs> I love this. 82% of you said neutral colors, which is funny because I'm wearing neutral colors. My sweatshirt, not so much, but like my shirt, it's just like a deep blue. I always wear neutral colors. Me You're too. wearing gray. This is like the only bright thing I have and it's pastel. So I would say once a week maybe I'll wear like yeah. some. I feel like just some. everyone looks good in neutral colors. Like yeah. black, gray, white, like complement every skin color and skin tone, I feel like. I 100% agree. You know, like everyone, everyone looks good in it. 
Okay, this one I was really interested about. I said, if oh. you drink energy drinks, which one is the best? And I put four just to see like the percentages. I put Red Bull, Monster, Rain, and Bang. Red Bull actually won with 5,000 votes, and then Monster was second with 3,000. Bang was third with almost 3,000, and then Rain Ooh. had 300. Wow. I feel like no one knows about I guess, Rain. I I'm guess it actually is actually surprised. Yeah. Bang kind of blew up, so I get that that one has a lot. Monsters been around. That's my second favorite. But Rain, like, I went through a Rain phase, and, like, I'm just surprised that a lot of people don't know about yeah. it. They're good. They're pretty good. They're pretty nice. They're, they, they they're taste like my very, third favorite. Yeah. I good. forgot about Rockstar when I was making this, so I wonder if I would have put Rockstar as option C. Like, it would have been more even. I am not surprised to see that Red Bull almost has 6,000 votes and won because I feel like... Red Bull's been around It's like longest. the energy drink. Like, when you think energy drink, you think Red Bull. And, like, Red Bull just has such a cool name. Such you know? a cool brand. Yeah, it's just, like, it's an just awesome Red brand. Bull. Okay. Wow, I'm surprised by this. Favorite exercise type, 65% of you said cardio. I feel like some people are lying. I put cardio. Because everyone always complains about cardio. Watch a workout video or a fitness journey and every single one complained about doing cardio, yet 65% of you are out here voting cardio. So what's the deal? I have a theory. Yes. So like growing up, unless you took a class where you lifted weights, you only like ran in PE. Mm -hmm. So I bet a majority of people have never even lifted weights, so they only know cardio. Would you rather work for someone or have people work for you? 60% of you said have people work for you, which I actually find a little bit surprising. Because like when you think about it, it's like there's obviously gonna be more workers than there are like CEOs, managers, business owners. So it's kind of weird, but also you have to start somewhere. Yeah, So it makes course. sense. That's interesting. I like it. I like, I like the diversity it. here. Okay, are you a dog or a cat person? 81% of you said dog. As our little cats hanging on the we table. We are cat people. I feel like people don't give cats enough credit. They really don't. Like most people grow up with a dog and then you become a dog person and people walk their dogs. You see dogs a lot so you just like subconsciously become a dog person. What but the, the problem is that some people get cats and they're demons. So well, you definitely like for us too we got hypoallergenic cats and I feel like everyone I meet says oh I'm allergic to cats. Cats are the best but you know I get it. Like I get it. Which one do you do first? Cereal or milk? <laughs> I am happy to see that 93% of you said cereal. But to the 7% who pours milk first how do you know how much milk you're gonna need? That's a great question. I never thought of that. Because you put cereal and then you just fill it up with milk. But when you just put milk in, it's like, what if it's too much? What if it's not enough? So I thought this was funny. So which one? Sock, sock, shoe, shoe. Or sock, shoe, sock, shoe. And we have 86% with sock, sock, shoe, shoe, which I feel like is normal. That, that's definitely normal. Yeah, but I am actually kind of glad to see like a good 14% out there like doing sock, shoe, sock, shoe. Like we just got to switch it up and be diverse as a society, you know? I cannot say I've ever met anyone that is sock, shoe, sock, shoe. Yeah. But I'm glad to know there's people out there. But I kind of want to try it out and see oh, how it no. goes. <laughs> All right, we have two left. Now this is the most important one. Here we go. Wings, bone in or boneless? I am mad. Oh, because 70% no. said boneless. 70%? Where are you guys at? Okay, let me just explain something. A wing without a bone is a chicken nugget. <laughs> and you will never change my mind. You're not going to wing stop, you're going to nugget stop. You're not going to Buffalo Wild Wing, you're going to Buffalo Wild Nuggets. And I'm definitely a bone in kind of guy, but in the in the boneless people's defense, I feel like most people are too scared to get the bone in because they don't want to get messy. Like when you get the nuggets, it's just fork in my mouth. But See, with the bone in- I feel like you guys don't understand that when the bone is in and you get messy and it it takes time. It's a the whole experience. new experience. It's one with the wings. <laughs> okay, last but not least, do you ride goofy or regular? Now this I find interesting because find we have 56% regular. Like the difference is not that bad. That's actually really surprising because regular is supposed to be like a majority of the people and then the minority is goofy, which is me. 44% of us are out here being goofy. But okay, that is it. That's all the
the questions I asked you and honestly this was really entertaining if you guys want to see me do another like survey like this leave the questions down below Ooh. and we could do like topic surveys maybe Ooh. that could be like a vlog channel thing I don't know let me know what you guys want to see because I thought this was really interesting me too that was yeah. fun Okay, well, that's it for today's video. Not as much of a vlog because it's a pretty chill, rainy, cold day. But on Thursday, we got a good vlog coming for you guys. So that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, then please leave a comment, subscribe, and turn on those post notifications. We love you guys, and we'll see you in the next one. Peace. Bye.